it going guys? Dylan from Luxury Lives On and I hope everyone's doing well today. We have traveled an hour in an Uber, we woke up at 6 a.m. and we're not even at the racetrack yet and the city of Long Beach is absolutely being terrorized by race cars. Today we are at the Long Beach Grand Prix and well, get ready because it's gonna be pretty epic. I don't know if you can hear me, but we are inside Long Beach Grand Prix right now. We are finding a good place to see the cars and it basically sounds like, well, Long Beach is under attack. American teenagers are playing video games online or on their devices. And for Josh, it was never enough. He went as far as dropping out of school so that he would have more time for gaming. He finishes later. Mom, no, Mom, I, I'm the last guy. He did use the bomb. JJ. Mom, look! Taking a quick break and a breakfast burrito. For now, there's silence. So while we have a bit of a break here, uh, first sense so far is this is pretty insane. I mean, these are the cars you see on TV. Uh, wide variety of sounds and noises, whether it be a V8, you hear that growl or the American cars or the raspy six cylinder in the 911s. A uh, lot of variety, very, very cool. Unfortunately, there was that crash. But the craziest thing is when you listen to these cars, you get a sense of just how powerful they are. It's really kind of mind blowing to really hear it in person. Conversation. <laughs> All right, so right now Andy is getting the earplugs out. Every time. 
time I hear the sound of a car, I flinch. in a city. They closed down Long Beach and an indication of that is your traffic lights right over here. Alright, so we've seen them racing. Now we're going to see what happens before the race. We're going to the paddock area where a lot of the cars get set up and are sitting around and maybe we can inspect them ourselves a bit. Crazy. So all the cars that we saw just speeding by, now we're up close with. You see all the marks and stuff from racing. Now we are in the Porsche section, which basically is the 911 that destroyed my hearing. So, so cool. It's obviously doing some prep and uh, a little look around because it just came off of racing. Damn. All right, so we'll segue to the Ford section with unfortunately a crashed Ford GT trying to be loaded off of the flatbed. Essentially, the wheel had sunken into the chassis, so good luck to them on that. And here's the Acura section. Look at those things, so outrageous. It looks like spacious. Alright, so they have a bunch of NSXs here, some of them being pace cars. Let's check them out. Hey, you probably don't want to ride in that. And I, I would like, I'd rather. I'll buy this one right now. Oh my goodness, this is neat. That is a ton of NSXs. Oh my god. On to the BMW tent, which has the new 8 series that they're actually racing. I drove that recently in a video if you guys saw, but it was slightly different from these ones. Yeah. I think they look really cool. Alright, so basically right now we're in the inspection area. So before the cars come out of the paddock, they come here. And before they go to the racetrack, they need to be inspected for all little things in case anyone's cheating. Shh. Yeah. 
there. Okay. Here we have some Indy cars lined up. quick because there's music in the background. New saline. And another crazy race car that I cannot recognize. I'm gonna be honest guys, it's just nice to be somewhere that's air conditioned with a cold beer. It was so hot out there. All right guys, so that is the Long Beach Grand Prix. I found the only place I could possibly find where we have a slight less bit of engine noise so you can actually hear me. Uh, pretty awesome getting up close to all of those race cars and hearing them. It's basically like, I don't know, it's absolutely addictive just hearing them. I lost my earbuds, so I might be screwed later, but uh, wow, really, really cool event. I suggest all of you go to the Long Beach Grand Prix. They literally cut open Long Beach and allow race cars to basically drive through, so that's pretty crazy to think about. Anyway, I'm gonna go stuff my face, buy some crap I don't need, and hopefully I don't get sunstroke. Thanks guys, and by the way, uh, big thanks to Cool Car Cases for this awesome phone case. Check them out in the link below. Uh, if you wanna see more of my content, please, I'm on Instagram, Facebook, YouTube, and Twitter. If you wanna see what equipment I use, check the Amazon links below. If you liked the video, give it a like. If you wanna see more of my content, please do subscribe. Thank you so much for watching. Peace.